In the last episode, we took a look at a $50 pair of wireless earphones, and they proved to be mediocre at best. These are the Jabby's B Twins, and they cost a crisp $100 bill, so let's find out if spending twice the amount of money is the answer. The box both looks and feels premium, and that continues to everything inside of it. In the accessory compartment, you'll find some quick start guides, spare tips of different sizes both with and without attached ear wings, as well as the charging case and its USB cable. Now the charging case is basic in its function, but it works really well. The earbuds get charged up pretty quickly and the case is definitely good for a few full charges, and it doesn't hurt that it looks really cool too. With a microphone, call controls, and play and pause controls, the only feature I've really found to be missing on the B-Twins are multimedia toggles, specifically the ability to skip back and forth between songs and a playlist directly from the earbuds themselves, but that's not really possible here. Apart from that though, there isn't too much to complain about. At $50, the previous earbuds we took a look at were a little underwhelming, so we set out to see whether or not spending more, specifically two times more, on a pair of wireless earphones would equate to an ideal overall listening experience. And when it comes to the build, the Jabby's B-Twins are absolutely up to standards. As for sound, they get very loud while also maintaining a punchy and prominent low end as well as crisp and airy highs. So even with a few minimal but existent Bluetooth connectivity faults, I would absolutely recommend the B-Twins to anyone and everyone in the market for some fully wireless earbuds.